Hello, welcome to the War Rising News Channel. Thank you for watching. All right, let's go ahead and spectate. The pie is a lie. All right, Mohawk vs. Orange Maniac. All right, we're going to be right back. Please stay tuned to the War Rising News Channel for further tournament commentary on this finals match. We are back, and woo ho! Oh. <laughs> Sorry about that. So someone tried to throw a pie at me. All right. Anyways, turn number one, finals match, Mohawk vs. Orange Maniac. Alright, let's go ahead and see what's going to go on here. So I think that Firo is going to switch to something else. I could probably tank the, uh, yeah, they could probably tank a possible rock slide. Um, Alright. This is turn number two. Turn number two. Yep. Um, yeah, and I'm trying. I'm trying to keep my 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 mic um, my mic plugged in properly because I don't know if if the mic is doing all right. I mean, yesterday the headset was not the audio was not really too good last night. So hopefully, hopefully my, my voice is just fine. Hopefully it's just fine. All right, good. Whew, good. Um, Rosalina came in. All right. Yeah, Steelix is guessing something, something really major. All right, so the spikes. Nice. First layer of spikes, though. That's amazing. All right. Whew. Does Orange Maniac have a rapid spinner for the final match? All right. Rosalina is going to switch into Shiny Steel. Oh, Shiny Steel looks nice. Nice, nice, nice. All right. A nice combo too. Um, all right, man. Ooh. Oof. Man, both opponents are really playing rough with each other. Now, something tells me that, that the, I don't know, maybe behind the scenes they're probably throwing pies at each other. All right. <laughs> All right. Walrein. I mean, man, had a pretty good night tonight. So, yeah, I was in Vermilion. I met someone, and uh, yeah, we started chatting. It was pretty nice. Um, All right. <laughs> um, I hardly ever go to Vermilion. Yeah, alright, so Mohawk is going to be doing Surf. Alright. Super effective. Hidden power. This is the first knockout. All right, pincer is coming in now. This pincer, I don't know if this pincer. I forgot if it's banded or if it has leftovers. I think it's banded. I think I don't. I don't want to say yet. Uh, yeah, I don't see leftovers, so I'm predicting that it is probably a banded uh, physical. Well, pincer is usually physical, but. Yeah, I assume that it, it its move set consists of, but is not limited to uh, double edge or return, earthquake, probably brick break. I'm assuming this is a choice banded set. All right, choice band. Oh, sorry, um, superpower brick break. Some people like to run brick break because they don't like the attack and defense drop after superpower. 
but that's, that's just kind of a preference that some people have with Pinsir. Um, Alright, so Pinsir is going to switch into Mistrevious. Alright, great. And, and uh, Rosalina is going to be doing Giga Drain on the on the uh, Mistrevious. Alright, great. Um, I don't know. Whenever I look at that tournament name, I... I'm reminded of the Three Stooges. The Three Stooges, they usually, they're famous for their pie fights, so. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't know. I'm not sure if Bilbert watched the Three Stooges or not. If he does, then uh, I would not be surprised that this would be the origin of the idea. I don't know. All right. But, nonetheless, it's still a pretty fun name. All right, so um, Shadow Ball, Shadow Ball is going to do a little bit to uh, Rosalina. Rosalina's special defense is going to be dropping, and Rosalina is going to be doing the second layer of spikes as well. This is not looking good for Orange Maniac. Orange Maniac can still win, but it's going to be a little tough whenever in some of his Pokemon come by. All right, so Mistrevious is going to be doing Heal Bell, and that means that uh, everyone that's poisoned or something along those lines, well, they're cured. All right, so Mistrevious is going to be doing Shadow Ball, and I, I like saying Mistrevious. All right, so not Knock Off, Critical, <laughs> critical it doesn't really matter if it's critical or not, but uh, but the Knock Off, though, it knocked off Leftovers, which means that Mistrevious' stalling days have come to a close. Well, at least on this match, but... House Expert! Alright, great. Oh! Oof! Oh! Mohawk's really going in for the kill. By golly, knocking off almost every single item. Wow, this is just epic. Can Orange Maniac live this? Can he live this? That That is the question. I don't know. Uh, it's going to be kind of... Uh, ooh, I don't know what the last Pokemon Mohawk... I don't know what the last Pokemon Mohawk is hiding from Orange Maniac, but if the last Pokemon is some sort of fire move... Or, sorry, some sort of fire Pokemon, then, uh, oh man, Orange Maniac has another thing coming for him. The, I, I already see kind of a weakness to Orange Maniac's team, and the weakness is fire. Anything you bring with fire types, well, at least from the information that I'm being shown here, if you bring anything that's fire, then that's, uh, that's not going to be a good day for Orange Maniac. Because he has Pinsir and Steelix. I don't know what the mystery Pokemon is, but I was assuming that that Walreen on Orange Maniac's side was kind of like the the check for the fire Pokemon. Alright, so Surf has done a lot to Mistrevious and has knocked out. Orange Maniac got a second knockout. This is not a good day for Orange Maniac, folks. Orange Maniac, I'm assuming that he probably has superpower uh, on that Pinsir. Superpower or return or double edge. I mean, I, I mean, we all know that, that he's going to be doing that he has superpower, but... Alright, so... That did a lot. And Pinsir got that poison point. And Orange Maniac cannot go to Mistrevious, which means for... Well, all the information I see here, for the time being... I mean... I guess I could say this. For the rest of the match, Orange Maniac can no longer rely on a Cleric. To heal off the poison. But I noticed that though that Pinsir is not. It's not. Uh, it's not banned. So yeah, it's just leftovers. All right, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. All right, Orange Maniac got the first knockout. All right. I thought I thought it was banded at first, but I guess uh, the way how Pinsir switched in and out, I guess it kind of tricked me for a ban for a banded set. 
Alright, I guess Orange Maniac was trying to throw people off guard, but... Alright. Although, um... I don't have the calculator, because, you know, it's going to take too much for me to calculate while I'm filming this, so... Yeah. Um... Ooh! Yikes! Mohawk is closing in on Orange Maniac here. He is closing in. Orange Maniac better find something that that uh, that can handle Mohawk's team here. Steelix is probably a pretty um um well. It gives Orange Maniac some hope, but the leftovers is gone on Steelix, so. Alright, so Steelix is going to be doing Earthquake. Er Earthquake's not going to really do much because uh, Shuckle has Monstrous Defense and Monstrous Special Defense. Alright. Encore! Alright, great! That means that, that Shuckle's probably going to switch into Steelix while Orange Maniac is going to be doing Iron Tail all the time. Oh, there's the last Pokemon. Alright, well... If Mohawk had a fire type, this would really, really not be a good day for Orange Maniac. And he does. Yikes. But the hidden power is super effective, so it's it's not HP fire. It's either HP water or ground or rock. I'm trying to think of all the weaknesses of fire on the top of my head here. Alright, so flamethrower. Alright, that's gonna do a number on Bell Awesome. Steelix is <laughs> Steelix probably doesn't want to come in on this. Oh man, Giraffe Rig is gonna come in, but that the, the, that spike damage is pretty bad. And who's faster? Flareon or oh, oh Flareon's faster. Alright. Uh, time for the probabilities. 90% chance that Mohawk is going to win. And that, due to the spike damage, it upped the chances to 98% of a chance that Mohawk is going to win this match. GG. Alright, wow. For the final match. Anyways, this is a... Oh, another pie, sorry. <laughs> Anyways, this is the World Rogers News Channel. Don't forget to comment or subscribe to my channel. Like or dislike the content that you see here. And before I get a pie thrown in my face, this is the World Rogers News Channel signing off. Fast, accurate, unbiased, World Rogers News. <laughs>